Hey, bestie viewers, are you a spice lover? We've all had those moments where we ate something a little too high on the Scoville scale. It can be a scary situation, but it's certainly nothing new. Chilies first came into common use in South America about 6,000 years ago. Over time, they've made their way onto your dinner table. In today's video, we're giving you the five spiciest peppers in the world. Just so you know, these are not the usual peppers served to you at your family barbecue. Some of them can do real damage. Do you know what the Carolina Reaper is? How about chocolate Trinidad Moraga? We're talking about all these and more. Chili peppers are the fruits of the capsaicin pepper plants. They are distinguished by their spicy flavor. Chilies are members of the nightshade family and are associated with bell peppers and tomatoes. While there are many mild varieties of chili peppers, such as cayenne and jalapeno, let's look at the five hottest in the world. Number one, Carolina Reaper. We're kicking things off with a big one. It comes from the same species as the fiery scotch bonnet chili used in West Indian cooking. The Carolina Reaper has a unique look. It's even complete with a scorpion tail. The Reaper was first found in the state of South Carolina. You'll often see YouTubers compete to see who can eat the spiciest one. It's both hilarious and painful to watch. All of the spiciest chili peppers of the world contain a compound known as capsaicinoids. There's also something you should know about called the Scoville scale. This is the name given to the measurement of pungency in chili peppers. The Reaper is tested at over 2.2 million Scoville heat units, or SHU, making it the hottest pepper in the world according to the Guinness World Records. Let me put it to you this way. Compared to your average jalapeno pepper, a Carolina Reaper can be anywhere between 175 to 880 times hotter. That's crazy spicy. It's even recommended you wear gloves when you hold it. If by chance you're planning to switch careers and become a pepper farmer, beware. The Carolina Reaper plant can grow to a height of over four feet. Have you ever tried a Carolina Reaper? What's a funny pepper story that you have? Sound off in the comments section and start a conversation with our bestie community. Number two, Moraga scorpion. This is the second hottest pepper in the world. Right from the depths of hell, the Moraga scorpion is a rare and popular pepper that was just recently discovered. It's native to the islands of Trinidad and Tobago. Once you get a bite of this chili, the heat won't stop. This pepper may lack the pungency of the Carolina Reaper, but don't be fooled. Moraga scorpion is still pretty intense. Don't be fooled by its fruity taste. When you consume an unreasonably spicy Moraga scorpion, the numbness will not provide you any relief. You see, when you eat spice, your body strengthens its defense mechanisms. It does so by inflating liquid-filled balloons in your mouth. You might get blisters in your mouth and throat when you swallow this pepper. By placing heat-resistant blisters under the top layer of your skin, your body tries to absorb the heat that passes through. But this is where it gets scary. This pepper contains so much capsaicin, it actually penetrates the blisters and keeps going. This causes severe burning for 20 minutes or more. Studies state that the heat level of Trinidad Scorpion ranges from 800,000 to 1.3 million SHU. Have I caught your interest? Well, then hit that subscribe button to watch more videos. Join our millions of followers for more amazing bestie content. Number three, Naga Morich. Also known as the snake, this pepper looks all wrinkly. It's smaller in size and is characterized by ribs on the outer peel. People who eat nagamorich not only add this pepper to their food, but also eat it raw. I mean, that's not for me, but you do you. Naga Morich is a hot chili grown in India and Bangladesh. Their pungency ranges from 1 million to 1.5 million Scoville units, making them one of the hottest peppers in the world. After conquering the scorching heat, Naga Morich delivers a rich, fruity flavor, ideal for making hot sauces. It's also dehydrated and ground to make chili powder or chili flakes. The pods of these peppers mature from green to bright orange or red. They grow to about 18 inches in length. Much like the Carolina, remember to always wear gloves when handling Naga Morich. The oil will burn if it gets on your skin. And who are these superheroes who eat these peppers raw? Their trips to the toilet must be miserable. Speaking of which, before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Are you concerned about the state of your skin? Watch and learn eight tips to make your skin healthier. Now back to our discussion on the hottest chili peppers in the world. Number four, chocolate Trinidad Moraga. Another pepper out of Trinidad and Tobago, it comes with a whopping 1.2 million levels on the Scoville scale. It's usually used for barbecue sauces. Apart from the heat, these chili peppers are rich in vitamins, minerals, and various plant compounds. This includes capsaicin. Their heat index is roughly the same, but there is a clear difference in taste between Moraga Scorpion and Chocolate Moraga. The Chocolate Moraga is lighter, smokier, and less sour in taste. 
But don't let this fool you. This is still one heck of a spicy pepper. It's almost like it has fangs. The heat hits you that hard. Comparing it to a regular jalapeno, this pepper is usually around 150 times hotter. But that's not nearly how intense it can get. The hottest chocolate Trinidad Moraga can be 800 times hotter than jalapenos. 800 times! What's even creepier is how subtle the spice is. You see, these chili peppers build the heat slowly. It starts with mild discomfort and eventually turns into a fiery hell. It's not to say it doesn't have its positives. It's always good to use these chilies in a mixture with other ingredients to relieve itching. Moving on. Number five, ghost pepper. Here it is, it's this super hot chili that started it all. May not be the hottest on our list, but it's still not something you wanna eat too many of. You've probably heard of the ghost pepper before. Fast food restaurants are always trying to fool you with their own watered down version. In reality, the ghost pepper isn't something you can easily eat with a $1 chicken sandwich. Let's go through a bit of history. Originating from Assam, India, this pepper was the first to break the 1 million mark on the Scoville scale. It's locally known as boot jalakia or ghost chili in Assam. Some go as far as to call it the poison chili. The ghost pepper has had a long history of winning awards. It was named the world's hottest spice by the Guinness Book of World Records in 2006, though it ended up being knocked down multiple times. Now, don't get me wrong, ghost pepper is still pretty dang hot. For some, just the smell is enough to make them burst into tears. Heck, if you eat one hot enough, your mouth will feel like it's on fire for half an hour. Ripe peppers are 2.5 to 3.3 inches long and are usually red in color, although yellow, orange, white, purple, or chocolate varieties are also available. Their skin is very thin and breaks easily. The hottest ones are 416 times hotter than the lightest jalapenos and about 208 times hotter than the average ones. Ghost peppers are not just spicy, they're also very sweet in flavor. But the sweetness is usually overshadowed by all the spice. You're just not going to have time to think about how sweet they are once you sink your teeth into one. There are some benefits to the ghost pepper, believe it or not. They're also used as remedy for indigestion and a way to combat the summer heat. Wait, it can combat heat? That's pretty nuts when you think about it. Not everybody handles spice the same way. When eating any type of chili, it's important to pay attention to your tolerance level. Using them as a condiment can be beneficial, but people with digestive problems should avoid them. Let's take a look at a couple more spice-related videos, shall we? Check out five hidden health benefits of spicy foods you need to know. Or how about relieving pain naturally using these herbs and spices? Go ahead, click one, or better yet watch both and learn how spices can actually help your diet. Do you or anyone you know love spice? Let us know in the comments below.